Hi everybody, it's me. Um, yeah, I'm in a weird place. It's really hot here in Canada, and I would normally be in my dining room or my living room, but I'm um, in my bedroom <laughs> because that's uh, where we have the best air conditioning. Uh, the living room and the dining room, the air conditioner it kind of sucks, but anyways, um, I wanted to, like I told you, um, put up my giveaway today, and I do have over 200 subscribers, and, uh, I've already showed you what, um, most of the things are, but I wanted to show, like, what kind of makeup product I put in, and, uh, a few other little details and my hair is terrible I can't help it I had the wig on today and um, it's just too hot to really do anything and I also have a burn right here if you can see right here I burnt myself um, <laughs> if you want to know why ask me um, Okay, so I'm just going to show you everything again really quickly, but I'm not going to go into detail because if you want to see that video in detail with the other stuff, then um, just go to my other um, um, sneak a peek video. So, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, just going to say there's three scarves, and uh, one is a. Uh, polyester. One is a uh, um, just going to say it's uh, acrylico or something. And this one which I like the feeling of the best is it's also polyester but it feels different than this one. I don't know why. I think um, they don't really say. So there's three scarves, and they're very beautiful. And the navy blue one feels like, um, very soft. It's like, um, kitten's fur. But, um, there's those three scarves. And, uh, also, um, Let's let me do this. There's these um, glasses, and these things are from our jeans. These are glasses, and they're black, and they have like a, a mirror finish inside them, and they're very cool. And I was gonna, <laughs> I wanted to keep them for myself, but I already have like too many glasses, and these ones are really cool. And I just thought. And you can see the reflection of the TV in there. But those are really cool. And uh, with those glasses is a pair of um, attachments. And what they are is like, uh, <laughs> you'd think like old people or old ladies or old men wear these. But what they do is they clip onto your glasses and they will hang nicely. And a lot of times, and the reason why I get these is because I will misplace my glasses and I um, it's very nice to have them just hung around your neck and that's just like a gold um, embroidery thing I don't know exactly what it was what it is and then there's um, earrings and these are the um, pearl and silver earrings with some um, gems down there and medium sized hoops. These are a little smaller but they're really cute and you could wear those anywhere like um, you could dress them up you could um, pretty much wear those anywhere so and uh, I do have another set of earrings and uh, these ones are just uh, 
And I really like these ones. These ones are just um, studs, and they're, um, well, obviously they're not diamonds. They're just like uh, crystal studs that um, would mirror off anything, wear anything with them. They're very modest, and they're all the same, so least I'm pretty sure they are. Yeah, they are. And they're quite cute. And <clears throat> next thing is these pair of stretchy gloves. I think everybody's always seen these anywhere you live. If you haven't, I'd find that weird. But they're just a pair of stretchy gloves. They're black. They go with anything. I wear these things all the time. Um, except in the summer. No, not today. Not today because it's very hot, but I live in Canada, so most of the time I'd be with, like, you know, if you wanted to take a percentage out of a year, um, it would be greater than 50, of course. And then, um, <clears throat> and then there's this. It's a black clip for your hair. You can make a French knot, and I'm not going to put it in my hair, but um, you can make a French knot, uh, weird, like a high ponytail, or you can just use it for a clip for anything, and it has um, jewels in it, which I really like. Like, um, I really like the clear crystals better than I like um, pink or any other color, because they're fashionable and they're nice and they go with anything and they look nice so that's another thing and these things are all the things that I've basically shown you and uh, then there's a, the pair of socks from Ardeen's and these are nice quality socks they are stretchy you can wear them whenever you want um, they're I call them bobby socks, but they could be sport socks. I don't know. Um, but to go with these socks, I decided, and this is something new, is to get a little Canadian sock, which is a purse and a keychain. I got a fuzz in my mouth, my hair. It's a Canadian little socky change purse. It opens up. But I'm not going to be messing with it. And it's got a little keychain if you want to hang it from your keys. And it's like made out of sock material. So it's stretchy. It's really cute. And uh, I like that. And uh, also, <clears throat> for Canadian things, um, it is one of these long, I think everybody has had one of these, I'm not sure. Um, they're a keychain, this one's Canadian. I'm going to try and let you see. If you look at the pictures at the beginning of this video, it's going to show you everything up nice and clear. And uh, it says Canada, and it's got the Canadian flag, and it's keychain. And it's fairly it's Canadian so and the next thing is um, well I always do because my channel is not primary a makeup or a certain kind of channel but I do do crafts and I made this little purse and um, it is I know so hot glue purse and that's the front and I did put um, in my own handwriting love right there but I didn't want to start doing how much of things to it but that's this is the back and it does have a little pocket here which opens up with a button and um, 
I don't know. Um, you could put, I wouldn't put too much, like it's just a more of a decoration pocket than anything. If you wanted, I guess I could have um, made it more stable if I glued that, but I didn't want to. And then there's um, studs here. The little, like, um, look like little pyramids. And this here is just uh, rhinestones. And this is a different color. I don't know if it shows up much on here, but it's blue. And uh, there's studs here. And then around the front, there's studs. And then I glued on these. Um, crystals here. This is a heart and the little uh, teardrop shape there and like a circle. And then here is the fastener and uh, you can open this quite easily. Just open it and inside the purse it's just a plain, because it's small, it's just a plain purse and then you can do it up quite easily you just just like doing up a belt which is actually where I got this um, piece of material from and you just do it up like a belt and it kind of looks like I don't know I really like the way it looks it's kind of like a tie and this is like the white part I thought would be like a little shirt underneath and then the collar is very cute because that's a style right now and with the back that's actually a cuff of the sleeve so that's really cute and then I just added some homemade little um, spots here where you could add the strap and the strap I did not make myself, but I um, recycled it. So because I'm I'm a lot about recycling, and uh, it can be shortened. It's got a, a a thing here. You can make it really short, or you can keep it long. And this is very usable, and I hope you all like that. <laughs> because I like making things. So that's another thing. And then to go in your purse, um, I decided to pick out an eyeshadow. And I'm wearing one now, but mine is different than the one that I'm going to show you. And it's from the Wet n Wild collection. And it actually tells you um, what to do. And this one is the comfort zone because I just want to just stick with something that everybody could try. It tells you to put this on your brow bone, your eyelid, your your crease, and your um, definer. And the colors are very, very nice. And I have to tell you, these are really pigmented. Um, you really don't need... Uh, a primer or anything like that with it, but um, I picked the neutral colors and the comfortable colors just because you really got to know somebody and their skin type in order to pick out like a fancy color, but I really like these. Um, this is, I have the, I forget what I have, and I don't have it near me, but I have it on now and it's very pretty and I just put it on exactly like it says. It can be darker. I've been wearing this for about six hours now so it does stay on quite nicely. So that will be in there and um, just because I'm Canadian I want to and when I do the Kinder Surprise uh, videos and um, it's too bad that I can't send a Kinder Surprise to anybody because it's illegal to send them because apparently a child, well, <clears throat> if you guys have watched my videos, apparently a child had choked on a piece of the toy. And uh, so what I'm doing for you is 
sending you out the kinder. You can see there that it says kinder. And I'm sure, and maybe I'm wrong, but some places in the States you can get the kinder chocolate. And this is a little bit, this is what the chocolate tastes like on the Kinder Surprise. Um, it's, it's a Canadian, like, it's such a good chocolate. It's like a milk-in-your-mouth chocolate. And then the filling is a hazelnut cream white chocolate. Like, it's just, you're going to die when you eat it. And don't be anywhere. Like, you have to eat this in a cooler because this stuff is so smooth and it melts and it's just wonderful. So, you're going to get uh, two of these and they have two in each of them. And uh, also, you're going to get these arrow. Um, these are lamb. Um, they're called lamb moot. Mouton, and these are arrow bars. And we, I, you do not have arrow bars in the states, but you have something similar to that. But these are mint arrow bars, which means they have chocolate on the outside. And these ones are shaped like a lamb. And then they have green mint chocolate on the inside in little bubbles. So when you take a bite out of it, it actually crumples and the bubbles melt in your mouth. So you're going to get two of those and you're also going to get two, and I didn't pick up huge chocolate because there's a lot of chocolate here, two Kit Kat bars, that's Steven's arm, two Kit Kat bars, and they're just small because I am spending lots, and two coffee crisps. And these are like Kit Kat bars, but they have like a, um, they have the wafers and the chocolate, but on the inside of the middle wafers is a thick layer of this coffee tasting, um, cream, like it's so good. Um, so you're going to get two of those. And the last of the chocolate, well, no, not the last. Um, the second last is you're going to get these Smarties, and I know in the States you guys have Smarties, and I don't know about the rest of the countries, but in Canada, Smarties are, people say they're like M&M's, but they're way better than M&M's. m and m has a uh, dark chocolate candy coating, but these have a, like a, a candy coating with a milk chocolate inside and they are so good like I'm addicted to these like if I start I cannot stop so and they're very cute and then I have another kind of arrow bar and these are just um the regular arrows and they're bubbly and they're milk chocolate and they do not have the mint inside just in case you don't like mint and then last but not least is these two necklaces with uh, a Canadian flag on the bottom. Or not a flag, but a Canadian maple leaf. And um, there's two of them. I tried to get a, more Canadian things, but because we had Canada Day a few days ago, um, everything was like... Usually they have like a whole aisle of stuff, but they only had like a small end of the aisle of stuff because people had bought them all up. So that's what you're all going to be getting. And I hope that you, um, to be in this contest, you have to be subscribed to my channel. And um, I um, want you to um, comment in the comment area of um, what your um, what you did for um, I can't even think if I was going to say Canada Day but um, what you did for the 4th of July or what you did in your uh, 
nation's um, national day. Ours is Canada Day. The U.S. has the 4th of July. I don't know what other um, places have. So um, put down what you did and uh, please um, be subscribed to my channel and I really don't want a lot of spam so uh, <clears throat> I would uh, prefer like if you're just gonna enter my channel just for the contest that uh, you uh, say that that's what you're doing and um, because I do not like people that subscribe to channels because of giveaways and then they unsubscribe so um, and I'm not trying to sound really rude like that but if you're going to subscribe to my channel say stay subscribed if not you know this is just a giveaway it's meant for people that enjoy watching my channel enjoy being um, you know a part of knowing me at least on YouTube and uh, I would love if um, you subscribed and stay subscribed and uh, get to know me because you will like my channel. I'm sure you will. I don't talk about only bipolar or makeup or health and uh, dieting. There's a lot of things that I do in my channel and... Um, I forgot this little guy here, and he's going in the box. He's a little owl with some body lotion in there. So do subscribe, and do like this video, and um, say down below what you did for your nations or, well, I guess your nations. Uh, holidays. So, anyways, um, I'm a little bit confused because I don't know what to say because I don't know what other countries do because I'm very, like, you know, I live in North America and we have, like, all I know is, like, Canada Day and the 4th of July and I think that's it. That's all I know. But, um, do that and what else was I going to say? Oh, um, I was going to say, uh, my, um, per, you know what, I can't say that yet. So, I have picked out a person who is going to be getting something from me. Um, I was just going to blab it out, but I forgot that I need to inbox them first. So, I'm going to be inboxing them right away and, uh, Look in your inboxes. Uh, anyways, I'm sorry this was so rambly and confusing, but I'm a little bit confused today, and I'm hot, and my back hurts, and we'll see you later. Please enter this contest, and subscribe, and like. Bye.